Felicia and today I have the rest of my Black Friday haul. Manivois de vous. De, don't, don't quote me on how to say that. I'm trying to learn my French. But it's Menier de vous. De vous. De vous. Um, sorry French people. I am so sorry. But beautiful name. Not sure what it means, but beautiful name. Um, it's a brand online, just like um, pretty much everything. But I got it, like JLux Label, it's one of those off brands that not too many people know about, but I've seen it for oof, maybe two years now. And they're also quite expensive, just like JLux Label was. So I was like, been waiting for that sale where I was just like, okay, this is my time, I'm here for it. So I got these items for Black Friday. I know I'm late on posting and uploading and everything. I Today is January 10th, 11th, something like that of 2021. And I just opened the package for the first time today. And I ordered it in November. Yeah, that was my mistake because one of the items is wrong. But hey, we'll see how that exchange return process goes and I will put an update in the description later when I get information on how that went because right now I don't know. Um, so I'm just going to be going through the items with you and I hope you guys like this haul. Okay so these are the first pair of pants. They're so cute. So me um, according to my physical therapist. Very me. They've got like little block rectangles patterns it's like the pattern throughout the whole thing just little sections and it has this flap i don't know what this is for no clue but the pocket's nice and deep oh that's just a pocket i don't need but very interesting very interesting um, this pocket's deeper than this one so you know asymmetry for the win i guess not sure but it's like a, it's very thick, like similar to like a Levi jean. So it's not like most jeans nowadays where they got like a lot of polyester and spandex in them where they like stretch a lot. Like these are pretty sturdy, like they don't have too much give. So like if you don't have your right side, it's probably going to be very uncomfortable. I got these in a size 10 and they fit perfect. Like it covers my stomach so it's pretty high waisted again it doesn't have much give but i have enough room in my stomach for food and activities and whatnot so i got what i need there got the little logo here on the back mini as the boss however you say it i'm sorry i'm pronouncing it wrong i know i'm pronouncing it wrong i'm sorry um it comes up just above the ankle. It has this button here. So it has two little alternate buttons that came on this first one, but I just made it a little tighter by snapping it onto the second one. And it's just, it's just so cute. I love it. Okay, these bad boys. I didn't order this. This is what they sent me by accident and replacement for my other pair of jeans that look very similar to these ones. Um, when I opened this, I was like, can I order black sequins? That sounds like something I'd do, but I don't think I did. Yeah, these, these aren't it. This is a size 12. I'm not even going to put them on because these are the 10s and they fit perfect. And yeah, this, I already know for a fact that this would not fit even if I tried to put it on. It's like way too long on the bottom part near my ankle. So there's no need for me to even attempt to put this on. It'll just be a hot mess, but this is a size 12. I don't know what the style of this is called because I didn't order it. But if you like black sequin jeans, they have them, I guess. I tried to look for it on the website so that I could at least put the name for people who looked at this and actually loved it. And here's the whole thing looks like. Got some cutouts here on the legs, on the knees. I guess it's 
someone's look. It's not mine. I don't. It's someone's look. Um, but description for those interested. It doesn't have any give, just like these jeans don't have any give. So if you find your size, then rock with it, I guess. All right, that's these. Okay, so we got a pair of leggings here. I don't know how I feel about these because the style, the color, beautiful, love it, 10 out of 10, recommend. But the tongue situation, your girl can't breathe out here in these streets and we don't, we don't, we don't like that. So these are, I'm pretty sure, a size 10. I can't even pull this band back to check because there's literally no give up here in this area whatsoever and I can't breathe and that makes me so sad because the length on this is perfect. You see this right here? This is my ideal leg length right on the ankle. That's perfect for me. And like the way it fits everywhere else, like the butt, the legs, no panty lines. Yeah, no panty lines. Like it's beautiful. I love it. It's great. Why the hell is it so tight in the stomach? Someone explain that to me. Because I feel like if I go up a size to a 12, it's gonna, like, I'm be swimming in it because every other aspect of this fits perfect except for right here. And that makes me so sad because I, I would rock these anywhere. It's just trying to zip it up was an adventure. So there's that. It does have right above here, if you can see this. Ooh. It has a latch, so it keeps that part secure, which is nice. And if it's stuck in enough, I mean, I guess if I sucked in 24/7, it would fit pretty good, as you all can see. But when I breathe, because your girl stay bloated 24/7, this is what it's like. So I don't know. It's weird that leggings that have stretch don't have stretch right here. That's it's just weird to me seeing as how the pants that are the same size that have no give because they don't have spandex or anything in them had all that room so it's was, it was just weird so i don't know i feel like I'd, i'll keep these for sure probably can't even return any of this at this point because it has been so long besides the ones in where like they messed that up um, I, just, I don't imagine that they'll take this back if i can get this maybe like tailored and some spandex or something inserted into the waistband here. I feel like that will help me out. It's just so odd, cause it's like the material, like right here, super stretchy, super stretchy, super stretchy. You hit this line right here and it's like rock solid. It's not going anywhere, it's crazy. But it's so cute, but that's crazy. There's no pockets, so in case anyone was interested, there's no pockets. Oh, this makes me sad, but I'll figure it out, I'll deal with it, and I'll give an update at some point. OMG, who is she? It's so cute. Got a sweater dress here. Comes down in the front to mid-thigh. Same in the back. Got, says, says, are you lost? So cute, I don't know what this I don't think it's actually a picture of anything. It's so cute. This is so soft. It's beautifully soft. Oh my god. It's like one of the things that I got from Jay Looks Label. Like, oh, they were all fantastically soft. Oh my goodness. It's so cute. I feel like this is a really good length. Get like some thigh high boots, heels, things, stuff I don't own yet. Um, this is super cute. I got this in a size 10. So pretty much everything that I got is in a size 10. So I'm happy that this actually fits because they're based in the UK. So trying to exchange and do all that is such, such a nightmare. But this is super cute. Hey guys, so we're back and it's a few days later. Um, so I do have an update on the wrong jeans situation. I messaged um, many years before I still need to figure out how to say their name. So sorry again for the mispronunciation in regards to getting the wrong pair of pants in a size 12. So it was again black sequin pants that I showed earlier and 
I expected them to say, hey, it's been like months and you're just now saying something, but no, their customer service is A1. They sent me this long apology. It was like, we're so sorry. We'll correct that free of charge. No issues. Um, they also put in there that if I could find like a eco-friendly way to dispose of those jeans, you know, so because they care about the environment, 10 out of 10. We love them. So they did send me the correct pants in this bag here. Again, this is the distressed, sorry, words, distressed patchwork straight leg jean and I asked them for a size 10 because I saw you know with the incorrect pants what the size 12 looks like and I knew that if I got this and that it wouldn't fit anyway and the jeans the other jeans in the 10 fit really well this is what they look like give you a full head to toe before I throw it on the back so it's just like different patches, different colored denim. Figured it's probably a little bit easier to show it that way because, you know, the camera angle's not gonna show too much once I do finally put them on. All right, let's pop these on. I'll be back in a second. Okay guys, so here's the fit. I like the design. I'm not sure if I like, you know, the fit too much. It's not really like hugging too much like other brand jeans do, but I mean the other ones didn't do that also, so um, not too much of a, comp ah, I don't know, I don't know. There's not too much shape, that's the word I'm looking for. There's not much shape in these. Um, the length is really good, it goes right at my ankle so like it fits mostly my concern here is like the stomach region as always there's no stretch in these at all so in order to even button it i had to suck in first and then button them so i'm trying to like imagine what these would fit like like if that eight first or something along those lines and something about this long detail here just seems real awkward to me. I don't know. It looks diaperish. I don't know. I don't know if that's on purpose, on accident, or whichever. But like the overall design, I feel like is me for sure. These are pretty deep pockets, so that's good. Back pocket is. Back pocket. We got back pockets too. Wow, we love inclusivity. Okay, got a little coin pocket here too. That's really deep. So like, I like the overall design. I just wish that you know it was more stretchy here, like more of a spandex material, not necessarily that you know it needs to be loose. Like that's that's not what I'm trying to say. I just wish that the material here allowed for some give without me having to like before putting this on and maybe not having the white fringe that highlights deep down all the way around into the back for the crotch that's very interesting design choice i don't know maybe on camera it looks better than it does in person because i'm pretty blind and can't see that distance so you know maybe it doesn't look that bad on camera it's interesting. I definitely wear it. I mean, at this point, I can't return it because they've already gone out of their way to give me this. So, I don't know. I'll keep it. I, I'll figure out how to style. I think this with like, just a plain white t-shirt, some white sneakers is like a vibe. Okay. I'd say the overall haul is a success. I definitely want to shout out Manny at Devoir for, for sending me these after months of not notifying them that I got the wrong thing, like your customer service is on point. So thank you, thank you so much for that. I love the clothes, definitely gonna be wearing them whenever, if ever I go out somewhere. I'm just really happy with this haul. Okay, I've been struggling with the camera for like the past 10 minutes, trying to get the frame right. I still don't have a tripod, kill me, whatever. Um, but 
This is the final outfit. It's a jumpsuit. It's so cute. I also struggled for the past 10 minutes trying to get the damn zipper up in the back, which hella annoying when you're trying to like do this by yourself, but it worked like because I tried this on beforehand to make sure it all fit and everything. And that first time was so easy zipping it up and then I don't know why it was such a struggle just now. Anywho, not your guys' problem, my problem and the camera moved because my phone died and all the things. Anywho, this is the jumpsuit. It's so cute. It's got like so much going on. Gives you sophistication, gives you business, gives you party. Hits all the marks. Kind of low back. This is um a large, like I think the largest size goes up to top. So this is a 12. I think a 10 maybe will fit better in the chest region, but not the pants. See, I'm not gonna return it. Granted, I don't think again I can return any of the stuff at this point, but if I had the option to, um I'd keep it because this tight region that kind of sticks out, and plus the pants are like really loose. You can see that, they're pretty baggy. It has like this strap here that you just wrap around your foot. So, unhooks off, wraps around the foot. Buttons. Gives you a skinnier leg. Oh, that's a vibe. I like that. That's cute. I love the button details at the bottom of all their pants. Very cute. Um, so it's got this adjustable loop up here so you give yourself more room in the neck. When it when I first tried it on earlier, the loop was like here and it was like super baggy. So I put it on the tightest one. There's still a lot of baggage here on the sides, but overall it fits. I wouldn't use like a strapless bra because for all that talk. I wouldn't use a strapless bra because the back is so low that you would see it unless you get like one of those clear strapless bras. Which I don't know. So for right now this is fine for me. It holds up what it needs to hold up. You can't see through it. So like that's really good. I was thinking maybe finding someone I was gonna look for someone to fix the gray leggings to also find someone that could like tighten this like that because then I feel like it doesn't really need a brawl because it fits exactly how I need it to fit. But I guess there's room for growth at 25, you know? It also comes with this belt. I'll show you the details on that. So it's like shimmery with white pleather, that is. Yeah, that's like a white pleather going through the shiny chain link. That's cute. So I'm not. Okay, so it's got the two hooks here. Like the one hook. And I guess you just hook it onto that end there. This chain here already pre-attached in the middle of the belt so I guess I could just attach it like that so unravel it Why is it so like this chain hangs down across we'll bring this hook farther across into the middle piece here that seems to work. That can 
look down this piece. I guess you can pin it back somehow. For right now, it's just gonna hang because that's just what it's gonna do. So this is it with the belt. Again, got the details on the legs. It's so cute. I love all of this stuff. It's like me personified or clothified. I'm out here inventing words, you know? I, I just love all of this, this wardrobe revamp that I got going on. I really regretted buying all the Black Friday stuff that I did. So I have one more video from 2020's Black Friday that I still have to film and everything. Um, but I regretted it at first because I was I thought I was getting holiday pay from my job for Thanksgiving, um, but the office was like closed that week, and I didn't get holiday pay because I wasn't past my like probationary period. So I was like, ooh, I lost money because the office is closed this week, and I didn't get holiday pay, and I just spent like five hundred dollars on things. Ooh. And that hit me for a little bit. But then now that I have these clothes that are well overdue because, I mean, I needed them anyway. And I didn't want to continue to buy clothes that just fit but didn't make me feel happy. Like the way all these clothes make me feel. Because to me that's a bigger waste of money because I'd buy it for functionality because it would technically fit. But... I wouldn't want to ever wear it which to me just seems like a waste of money like just buy something that you know you plan on taking care of longevity I mean like unless you're in a situation where it's like you have to you get what you can sort of situation which I've been in that situation for like the longest time until more recently um, and since I'm I'd consider myself no longer in that immediate situation I'm gonna get what I want. Treat yourself. That's my vibe all 2021. Treat yourself. You deserve it. You work hard. Get your bag and get your clothes. All, all the things. All right, guys. I hope that you like these haul videos. I really enjoy making them. I really enjoy opening these packages and being happy with what I actually ordered. That's making my whole lifetime. And hopefully there's plenty of more to come in the future, you know, as I work a little more and get more money and really redo this wardrobe because my closet's empty right now outside of these little things that I just bought. Granted, there's nowhere to go, which is even better because it gives me time to accumulate all the things that I want. If you've tried this brand before, let me know down below how much you love it because this shit's on point and can't anyone say otherwise so let me know if you like these sort of videos give it a thumbs up let me know if you're interested in checking out their clothes after watching this i'd like to know that it helped somebody in this journey all right guys i will see you in the next video